And this is the kind of memorial being dedicated tomorrow morning at the Air Force Museum in Dayton. It honors local Gold Star families. An Ohio family is the reason that it's happening. And it'll be the 50th one in the United States. The family tells Local 12's Tessa DeTiro that its meaning helps them all heal. I wear it every day. I, it doesn't come off. That's the gold star pin given to Leslie and James Groves. It's been five years since their son, James III, made the ultimate sacrifice. The fourth time we said he was pushing his luck, and he was. He joined the Army right out of high school. Leslie remembers James asking that if something ever happened, he wanted to be buried at Arlington National Cemetery. Well, you're earning the right to it by being overseas. I said, but you better not come home to Arlington. James was killed serving in Afghanistan. He left behind a wife and two sons. The Groves work through their pain by talking to other Gold Star families. Or somebody says a phrase or turns just so, and it takes you back to that moment. For the last year, they worked to bring a Gold Star monument here. It does honor my son, and anything that honors him, he, he has well earned, and so have all the others in the area. It's hard for them to visit Arlington. Now they're thankful to have a place to visit that's a symbol of his service. To those individuals, we owe a great debt, and that's a national debt. We can never repay. In Kettering, Tessa DiTiro, Local 12 News.